Hello everyone, it's me, Vintage Gaudi. Welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. I just came home from a cellar. And as you can see, I have here a box. This box is full of toys. Mostly Polly Pockets and some Barbies. And I can't wait to show you what's inside of the box. So let's get started after the intro. The seller I just came from is selling all her vintage toys and I took the opportunity to go and drive by her house and buy a lot of stuff. So mostly here in this box they are Polly Pockets, amazing, very cool Polly Pockets and some very beautiful Barbies. Also all vintage toys. If you are interested, if you are living in Switzerland and you are interested in buying vintage Polly Pockets and some Barbies, you can check out her Instagram account, the link is down in the description box. This is no paid advertisement, I pay everything on my own and that was quite a lot, but I got a lot of cool stuff. So let's jump in and have a closer look what's inside this box. It is quite a lot. I want to show you every single piece, so I put this box by side. What is the first thing I... I'm going with this Polly Pocket. A super cute green heart from 1989. It is the Ponies Club, Polly's Pony Club. This is definitely a horse topic. We've got the original characters, so this compact is complete. This little horse and Polly, of course. Let's go to the next one. Next one I bought is this cute locket. It is from 1991 and in quite good condition. It looks very sweet, the flower shape from the front and inside we have Polly in her music locket, is it called? So here this is Polly listen to music and on this side we do have some kind of a disc table, a DJ table, <laughs> disc jockey table, DJ table, some speakers, so very cute. This compact or this locket is also complete with the original band here, so very, very cute. The next one I choose is also the locket. This one is called the Dress Up Jewel Locket. So also very tiny locket, from the outside you have this beautiful blue jewel here and this is also from, oh no, this is from 1992. Let's have a closer look to the inside and here she is. This is the dress up jewel locket and here you have this treasure and inside of the treasure is the blue diamond and of course Polly, she's also wearing a diamond in her hair. This compact or this clocket is also complete with the original cord here, so very cute. Let's go forward with two cute rings. I always told my friends I don't want to collect rings, I don't like them. Uh, they look a little bit strange and you cannot really do uh, anything with them. But then I occasionally bought some rings in a bundle of other polys and then I have to say they are really cute <laughs> and now However, I do collect some of the rings. This ring here is called Rosie Learns Ballet. So she is on a ballet dance class. Here we have the piano playing the music and she's doing some ballet pirouettes or something like that. On this side we have Susie goes on safari. So she is on a elephant and is going on a safari. Both of these rings, they are super cute. The next piece I want to show you is a Barbie. <laughs> Here she is. And with her we have a lot of stuff. We have a scissor that belongs to her. We have a comb. And we do have some little accessories. 
This Barbie is from 1994 and it's called the Cut and Style Hair Barbie. So you can cut the hair, she has very long hair, and you can cut the hair with this scissor, like so, but I don't do this. And on the back she has um, some, some kind of a space here where you can attach extra hair and then you can cut this hair. But of course I will not cut, cut her hair, but it's very cool to have a complete Barbie set, the cut and style 1994 Barbie. The next piece is a poly pocket, a red poly pocket or pink compact with a red diamond or a ruby in front. This one is from 1992 and it's called the Jeweled Palace. Let's have a look inside. This is how it looks. We've got the original poly here and the monkey. So this compact is unfortunately not complete. It's missing the treasure box with the ruby inside but maybe I find it separately but I still wanted to have it because I like the color and this one is so cute. Next piece I want to show you is also a Barbie. This Barbie is from 1993 and it's called the Fountain Mermaid Barbie from 1993. So she looks like a mermaid, she has some color in her hair. So I think when you put her in water the color of the hair will change. She has some glitter parts in her hair and this beautiful mermaid dress and you can see here the tail or the tail, mm, is it called the tail? Anyway, the piece from the mermaid that is so amazing. Look how big this is. So cute. And she has also her original accessories. This is a comb, a seahorse comb. Then a beautiful crown with some diamonds inside and the fountain. So here you can put the water in, squish it like that and then behind the crown you place it some kind of, you place it behind the crown and then water is coming off the crown. <laughs> so very cool feature. I don't know if I tried, mm, maybe not. So I'm very glad that I have her in my collection now. I'm primarily not collecting Barbies, but when I come across some Barbies from the area, I grew up in the 90s and they are complete with all the stuff. So I have to buy them when I really like the outfits and the pieces that came with these Barbies. So let's go forward with the next piece. The next one I want to show you is this cute little green heart. It is from 1991 and it's called Mitch's Bedtime Ring. So I hope I'm right. Let's have a closer look if it's so. Yes, this is Mitch's bedtime ring. Unfortunately, the dog is missing and I'm not sure if the ring is the original. I think the original one on onlypolypocket.com where I reference all my polys has another bed blanket. The one is in green or mint color and she has also another pyjama on with some green dots. In this case, she has blue dots. But anyway, I find it very cute and so I had to have her and now she's in my collection. Resting by the rings. I have here a square compact in blue. This one is also from 1991 and it's called Polly's Dinner Time Ring. Let's have a closer look. This one is so cute, <laughs> I really love it. Here also is a dog, I think there is a dog coming with this compact or with this ring box. He's also unfortunately missing, but anyway, I think the most important pieces are here, the table, the ring itself and Polly. This one is also super cute. The next piece is only a half piece I want to show you. So we are talking about this crown palace. 
unfortunately it is broken and only a half piece of it is remaining here but we have the original dolls that came with this compact and I do order this compact I found it on another platform where the dolls were missing so I buy the compact from the other platform and I have the dolls that belong to that one but all in all this one is also very cute compact even though it's only the half of it but it's totally okay the dolls I have and the complete compact is coming later with the post I also did buy some accessories from Barbie so in this case I bought this beautiful ball gown and the matching cape that belongs together so very cute and here are other clothes from Barbie that I bought from her this beautiful I think it's a ballet dress here um, skirts so two skirts in typical 90s look so bright colors and some mixes of different pieces or different topics or I don't know what is really going on on these skirts but they look very cute a matching top from the skirt and this one is also super cute this is a trouser a short trouser with a top all, all clothes from the 90s and also for my Barbie dolls next piece is once again a Polly Pocket that I bought from her this is the Ice Kingdom from 1992 let's have a closer look this compact is complete we have the original Polly the cute ice bear and this diamond in the middle of the compact this one is a very lovely compact and once again a Polly Pocket compact or to be correct it is a house it is the pizza house from 1993 yes it is 1993 super cute compact or super cute house and we have three original figurines that came with this compact so one is missing and I will search for the missing doll so I have then a complete compact and here this also works with light we tested it so the light is working and that is super cute I love the pizza compact or the pizza house yes I told a lot of times I don't want to collect the houses um, but yes my opinion changed a little bit as far as I have seen they are super cute and you can do a lot of stuff and most of them are light lighting up so I definitely wanted to have this pizza compact or this pizza house in my collection so the last pieces from Polly Pocket that I bought from the seller is or are these two figurines These two figurines belong to the Cinderella Enchanting Castle or Enchanting Cinderella Castle. Um, these two pieces I missed in my castle so I'm very glad she gave them to me. Of course I had to buy them but I'm glad they are now in my collection and are a little bit completing my Cinderella Castle. And the last piece I bought from her is this beautiful hula Barbie. This Barbie is from 1996 and I had to have her only because of this amazing hair color. Look this color this is so damn cute. I really love them so from yellow, red, orange, every single color. A little bit of pink in it so this one is really cute. And she has her original skirt on, her hula skirt. An accessory here as a bracelet and um, she has the curl in her hair the matching comb that belongs to her but a little rose is missing a head hair piece but that is totally okay as long as she is 99% complete I really love it look this color I'm totally amazed about this beautiful color this one is on the camera it looks more red but it is really pink orange in the middle of it it's really red then here it's orange 
yellow and the white hair. So this one is so cute. And I only had to have her because of the hair color. So now this one is my last Barbie and the last piece I bought from her. And now you can see all the three Barbies that I bought from her with their original accessories. I'm so happy that they are in my little Barbie collection. Here you can see all the Polly Pocket stuff that I bought from her. And I'm super glad that they are now joining my collection and be part of it. Especially the Pizza House Compact is so cute with the light that works. I didn't show you yet because um, the battery is not in. But all in all, this was totally worth to go by her house and buy a lot of stuff. So now my collection is growing. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a big thumbs up, click the subscribe button and we will see us in the next video with Vintage Gaudi. Bye!